Hey Peter, it's Paolo. I just wanted to show you everything is running correctly on my MacBook. And so I have the RX5 connected to the Mac and when I press the space bar, it starts. And, when, and I'll, I'll run you through the settings. So in the back of the RX5, obviously you have the two audio outs. Uh, and then uh, here in the MIDI in, I have the cable going to the MIDI in and the other side of the, the MIDI going to the MIDI out from um, the audio MIDI interface. In this case, it's a focus right and you know, yours will vary, but you know, basically standard out to in. And um, then in logic, you want to go to, you wanna go to, let me focus. When I go to file and then project settings, and synchronization here and uh, here you want to go to the synchronization uh, tab and hit MIDI and here it probably what happens you don't ha you have to specify the MIDI destination at you want to do so i already did mine the scarlet 4i4 usb if it's not there it's not going to work so you know in your case just um open it up select your sound card or media interface select it and then uh check put a check mark on it so yeah all you need to do is select the, your media interface and um, turn on the the clock out from logic and then the same thing on the RX-5 side, you wanna press a sync button here. It will take you to the clock and using the plus one and minus one button, you can change the settings here. So we can see this. So it defaults to internal, so you need to change it to MIDI to make it slave to the Mac. The other two are for different purposes, it's from tape, uh, Externals from like CV gate, but you know, you want to use media. I assume that you're using media.